All right, I just got that new 3K carbon fiber helmet from 509. Now it's time to attach a GoPro onto it. And I'm gonna share with you my method of getting that GoPro on your visor. All right, our goal is to attach our GoPro to the visor of our 509 helmet. We have a couple hurdles. We wanna make sure it's out of eyesight so we got the visor in the up position. But this helmet has this aggressive peak there. So we're gonna to have to apply a little bit of heat and then we're actually gonna use a rivet to attach it to the helmet. So we've removed the visor and we got our flat GoPro mount and we're gonna be using a rivet to attach it to the visor. The first thing we need to do is countersink a hole in the middle here so that when this rivet is attached, it's flush and doesn't interfere with the uh, sliding action of the GoPro. All right, once you've drilled your hole, you wanna double check and make sure that that rivet isn't sticking above the plastic so that it doesn't interfere with when you're sliding the GoPro on and off. Use your mount as a guide on where to draw the hole. So you just put it up on the opposite side of the visor of where you wanted it and then mark up your hole. Now after you've drilled your hole, you can either use your wife's hair dryer or I got this little heat gun. You wanna heat up that visor to make it more pliable. Once we put that rivet through, we drop that washer on and then we're gonna use a socket kind of as a press. So we'll press down on that socket. That'll flatten that visor out and make that rivet sit flush. All right, so that's how it's done. GoPro mounted the helmet. Time to hit the mountain. Let's see what you capture on your GoPro this winter.